Welcome back, dudes. We're going to jump right into it and get started. Thanks for watching. We have a phrase lesson today, which is when you put more words together. We're going to talk about four phrases with the word hang. One thing to notice is that in the word hang, the A is a long A. Actually, the word hang means this. We can put this cup and hang it on a hook. We can hang our laundry out to dry in the sun. We hang Christmas tree ornaments on the tree. Or we can hang our clothes up like this. But it doesn't mean that in today's phrases. Hang up. Hang on. Hang in. And hang out. Let's check them out. First up, hang up. So this is a phone. We know the green button means you're going to talk to somebody. But the red button means you will stop. And we can call that hang up. So you can hang up the phone when you're finished. Next we have hang on. And hang on just means wait. So we could say hang on a minute. Hang on a second. Or hang on a bit. And a bit just means a little time, just like a second. Hang on. Next up, we have hang in there. If your friends are having a bad day, like this sad boy and this sad girl, or if somebody loses a game or is just having a bad day, you can say hang in there kind of means don't give up. Don't be a baby. Hang in there. Be strong. Hang out is our fourth one today. That just means be with your friends and maybe do nothing important. Do you want to hang out at my house? Okay, sure. Let's go. Hang out. Okay guys, so let's review these four. First, hang up. It means if you're on the phone, hang up and stop talking. Number two was hang on, which just means wait. You could say hang on a minute, hang on a bit, hang on a second, they're all okay. Or just hang on. Next was hang in there. So if your friend is having a bad day or lost a game, you could say, Hang in there, buddy. It'll be okay. The last one was hang out. And that means maybe just sit around, don't do much, but be with your friends, having fun. Hang out. 